All right, Hilltop and fans, we are here in Dallas, and it was a wild and crazy one as Western Kentucky was, uh, pulls off a big win over Western Michigan, back and forth, but, uh, and Corey Munson. You're, uh, he didn't get the MVP, but he made that MVP kick. He could have. He could have. <laughs> but, man, what a game. 23-20 win. Uh, you coming, coming down to the wire, like, this is kind of like the Marshall game. You know, Western was tied there. I think it was right at 2020 as well, and Marshall got that game-winning kick to win it. Yeah. Well, this time was different. Western was like, well, let us do that to, to get their kind of revenge and kind of get that going for them. I mean, Corey Munson, the true freshman kicker, came out there a 52-yard field goal to win the game. And they're now last year 3-9. and nine. This year he finished the year 9-4. and four. Got a bowl win. Just heck of a turnaround in year one for Coach Tyson Hilton and his team. And, man, just what a game. Yeah, I mean, you, you talk about Corey Munson's heroics, the 52-yarder. I mean, he missed a chip shot over yeah. the game, you know, that uh, could have made it 13-10 to 10 going into halftime. Instead, it was 10-10. to 10. I think it was like a 29-yarder you missed. Or Something like that. Yeah, I think it was 29 yards. So, But, you know, uh, Coach Hilton talked about it. You know, he's had confidence in him all year. You know, he said the best way to best way to really uh, help out a freshman kicker is just keep taking, you know, keep letting him go out there and uh, and kick field goals. So that's what he's been doing. He's been a little inconsistent, but... You know, he's proved he's got a strong leg. Yeah. And, you know, he's proved that he can uh, he can become something special. You know, Western Kentucky if he keeps working on his craft. But I mean, big he came up big in a big moment today. So top of Corey Munson too. You look at Lucky Jackson. His last game as a Hilltopper come out here, 17 catches, which which would beat his own record for most catches in a single game mm -hmm. in Western history. 140 something yards. Just a great game for him. Also, you look at the Corey and Darden defensively. Also yeah. a senior. Had a great uh, play on that fourth down. Yeah, Ty Story's yeah. last game, I mean, 358 yards. He completed, what, like 35 of 51. I mean, just all around, great performances tonight. He scored only 23 points, but yeah. to get a big win like this in cap the year is pretty impressive. Exactly, yeah. I mean, that's exactly how you want to go out. I mean, it, I think statistically, Western Kentucky dominated. They had some turnovers. Uh, they had some personal foul penalties. Kind of, yeah. kind of hurt them, too, a little bit. A couple of those Western Michigan drives, particularly, I know uh, their touchdown drive there in the third quarter. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it, it, was, it wasn't a perfect game, but, I mean, uh, you know, the, the seniors did what they had to do. Yeah, you know, the key players stepped up. I mean, the, not a senior, but Josh Simon, a true freshman. Yeah, he's going to be good. Another true freshman uh, really had a really good game. I mean, he kind of showed some signs of what he will uh, become for Western Kentucky in the future. Yeah, it's been fun in Dallas, though, this week. It is. And cap it off with a bowl win like this. So we, pretty fun coverage today, fun stuff. More to come, of course, on the site. But, yeah, Sean, Tyler, Dallas is the, the place. We had fun, didn't we? We did. You ready? I'm ready. All Let's right. close out shop. See you guys.